In today's tutorial, I wanted to show you how you can balance out the tone in an image when you've shot it during really harsh sunlight hours. Um, in the case of this photo, I shot it, I think it was around 1.30 p.m. So that's pretty much at the time that the light is the harshest. And I did shoot this image backlit, but so I could get the background and the model exposed, I sort of compensated for it while I was shooting and the model has turned out a lot darker. So I would like to show you all how I would fix that in Lightroom. So the first thing that you would think to do is to bring up the exposure. However, if you bring it up, the model starts getting exposed nicely, but the background is totally blown out. And you could bring down the highlights for that, but it doesn't really save it as well as it could. So we're just gonna undo that and I'll show you the method that I would use instead. So for this, we're gonna have a look at the highlights, shadows, whites, and blacks, and use these tools to get the image looking nice and balanced. The first thing that I wanna do is bring up the shadows, which will in turn bring up the brightness of the model. So let's bring that up a little bit and I'm quite happy with that. And already you can see the difference um, of bringing up just the shadows rather than the exposure. Now, I would like to bring a little bit of detail back in the sky. So I'm gonna bring down the highlights a bit as well. And that'll just bring back a little bit of the color and not have so many uh, blown out parts in the background. Now, after we do this, you can see that the image is sort of lacking a bit of contrast because we have flattened it out by bringing up the shadows. It's um, definitely looking a little bit flat. So I'm gonna bring down the blacks and bring back a little bit more of that contrast that we had lost before. So that's looking pretty good so far compared to the original. Um, I would think I'd still want the model to look a little bit brighter. So I'm gonna bring up the exposure just a touch about there. And then I wanna bring up the contrast a little bit as well. And once again, bring up the exposure and then maybe play around with the highlights a little bit. And then let's have a look with the whites. There we go, just bring them down a little bit so this section of the sky is nice and colored. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much it. That's how you can edit an image, um, an image's tone without just using exposure, which just sort of does the overall image. I really like to focus on using the more refined controls to get a little more control over where I bring in more light and where I take it out. There's a before and after. This is the before, and this is after with our tonal adjustments. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. It's uh, something super simple, but I think comes in really handy while you're editing photos, especially if you shoot with natural light most of the time. Um, if you have any questions, please leave it in the comment section below. I'd be more than happy to answer anything you might want to know. And thank you so much for watching. Bye.